Hi guys, Rod from Bensonian Music Videos here, and this is week 23 of Code Island Discs. My focus biography this week is on Amy Lee from Evanescence. Amy Lynn Hartzler was born in 1981 and is a singer, songwriter and pianist. Amy is no stranger to suffering, losing one of her sisters, Bonnie, at the age of three from an unidentified illness and a brother, Robbie, who died in 2018 after struggling with severe epilepsy for most of his life. Lee's family moved several times when she was growing up, but finally settled in Little Rock, Arkansas, where Evanescence was formed when Lee co-founded the rock band with guitarist Ben Moody. The two met at youth camp and started playing acoustic sets at Arkansas's bookstores and coffee houses. The two eventually recorded their first EP in 1998 and a second one in 1999, selling them at local venues. In 2000, they recorded a longer EP called Origin. The demo contained three songs from Evanescence debut album, Fallen. Probably the most famous song from that album is My Immortal, which is the song cited this week in COVID Island Discs. In 2003, Moody left the band citing creative differences. Ex-Cold guitarist Terry Balsimo replaced Moody in the band and he also became Lee's writing partner. Business-wise, things got a bit fraught as in January 2014, Lee sued Wind Up Records for unpaid royalties to Evanescence. By March, she had been released from her contract with the recording company and announced that she was now an independent artist. In April 2020, Evanescence announced their fifth album, The Bitter Truth, which would be released in fragments throughout 2020. Such is the reality of online music. During her career, Lee has worked on a significant number of musical projects, apart from her work with her band Evanescence. In fact, one could say her career has been fairly eclectic, and if you want to learn of all the various projects she has been involved in, then do check out the Wikipedia article on Amy Lee, as there are too many musical collaborations for me to cover in this brief biography. Just to give you all a brief feel of some of the things she has been involved with, in 2008, Lee sang a remake of Sally's song for Walt Disney Records, and this song was part of the soundtrack for the movie Nightmare Before Christmas. In 2011, Lee also covered Halfway Down the Stairs for the Muppets Green album and I'm So Lonely I Could Cry, which was a song that appeared on the tribute album to Johnny Cash that was released in 2012. In 2008, Lee also announced she was working on a solo album project, saying she wanted to go back to her really old roots to show that she was not just a one-trick pony. In 2013, Lee announced she had teamed up with the American composer Dave Egar to create music for the American drama film War Story. In 2016, Amazon.com announced Lee was scheduled to release the family album Dream Too Much, which featured original music for kids and families. Interestingly, this album had Lee's father as lead vocalist on Goodbye My Love along with her sisters. Turning to Lee's personal life, she was in a relationship with lead singer Sean Morgan, but separated due to his addiction to substances. Apparently the song Call Me When You're Sober from the album Open Door is about him. Lee would later marry Josh Hartzler, a therapist, and the song Bring Me to Life, which is cited on day 291 of COVID on Discs, was inspired by him. Lee and Hartzler had their first child in 2014. Lee also identifies as a Christian, but states that Evanescence is not a Christian band. So that brings me to the end of my biography this week. Now let's move on to week 23 of COVID on Discs. So week 23 was from the 22nd to the 28th of August 2020, covering days 155 to 161. The songs that were added to my playlist this week were The Heart of the Matter by Don Henley, Because of You by Kelly Clarkson, my Immortal by Evanescence, Stay With Me, Shakespeare's Sister, No More I Love You by Annie Lennox, Don't Give Up by Kate Bush and Peter Gabriel, Sympathy for the Devil by The Rolling Stones. Each week I also produce a playlist video and on this page I state my favourite video of the week. 
For week 23, it was really tricky to select the best video because so many of them were exceptional. I strongly recommend watching the videos to the song My Immortal, Stay With Me, No More I Love You, and Don't Give Up. All of them contain excellent footage to capture the essence of each song. However, I think the video that wins my vote for this week is Kelly Clarkson's Because of You, as the video very cleverly captures the conflict between a man and a woman with a child caught up in the middle of the conflict. Yet superimposed on this present conflict is the parental conflict that occurred many years earlier where the woman, who is now the subject of the current conflict, is now just a frightened little child watching her parents' marriage shatter before her eyes. Therefore, the phrase, because of you, is full of double meaning as the subject of those lines is more than one man, the abusive husband of the present and the absent father of the past. Okay, so that brings me to the end of this week of COVID Island Discs. If you enjoyed this video, please do hit the like button below and tell your friends about COVID Island Discs. Also, if you want to see more of my content, then please do subscribe to my channel by hitting the subscribe button and the bell notification key if you want to be notified of my latest videos. I would also love to hear your comments about the songs I've included in COVID Island Discs, either in the YouTube chat or on my website chat. Finally, if you're new to my channel and want to access the YouTube video cited in this video, then please go to the text directly below this video and click on either the link www.bensonium.com forward slash COVID Island dash week 23, which will take you to the first song of week 23. Or alternatively, you can also go to the main COVID Island disc page which has three video playlists that contain all the songs I have cited so far using the link www.bensonium.com forward slash COVID Island. So until next time, hope your body and mind are in a good place and see you soon on COVID Island Discs. Bye guys.